Hey, I'm Birdman. Hey, I'm Michael. Time to get on target at the hub. Another week, just like that. Two minutes. Same clothes. Boom. Same bat time. Same bat channel. Literally, same <laughs> place. <laughs> so today, the C three hundred eight from Century Arms. Do, do, do. What is this beast? Why would you want it? It's kind of sexy. Oh, it's beyond sexy. It's a three hundred eight MP five. That, that wood is just, it's like, it, like I said, like it went to war already. Yeah, I bet you that is like um, military, you know, leftovers. It's like the barn wood of guns. I don't know. I don't know, whatever. Yeah, <clears throat> I made that up. So, um, <laughs> anyway, what is the C-308 Sporter? Well, it is a 308 caliber rifle um, that uses a b delayed blowback system, just like the MP5. Um, so you get that cool charging system where you charge it up, lock it, and you're like, what that? And it just slaps forward. Only in this video that you're going to watch in just a minute of me shooting, it doesn't slap forward very good because this is a brand new range rental that I love when my guys don't clean and lubricate well. So <laughs> this gun was just sitting on the wall. Uh, I don't know if it's been rented much. If it has been rented, they definitely didn't clean it. It beat up a couple rounds. Um, yeah, so this gun definitely ate some rounds. We definitely had some jams. That is not something that you can hold against this firearm because I think if it was cleaned properly, again, lubed and oiled. I love that term. <laughs> lubed and oiled. L lubed and oiled really well. Um, super well. Um, we need some Barry White music right about now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> um, so... If it was lubricated correctly, it would have cycled no problem. Uh, very accurate rifle. Um, and you can kind of see, we, so we did a little test with the rifles. I did a prone, just like open, standing straight up shooting. And then I leaned against a barrier or one of the lanes. And I'm telling you this, with this rifle, it was night and day difference. Yeah. So standing up, my group was, you know, a, a good, you know, soccer ball, maybe a little bit bigger. Um, standing against a lane, leaning into a, a, uh, a lane, you know, like a table and to a lane. Um, I mean, probably like a baseball. And I got to tell you, this gun, not only can you shoot somebody real far down range, but the ejection port it shoots it forward. So you're going to take somebody out to the right, about six feet out, you can center punch them with a uh, cartridge. And yeah. It's like, that, it would hurt. <laughs> <laughs> it does eject the rounds really well, and it's, it's very forward, and it's always usually at the same angle. So to me, that means it's tuned correctly. Yeah. The gun is definitely set up right. It's just, it was dry. Just straight up dry. Hmm. All right, ready? Five eighths by twenty four muzzle brake easily put on a different suppressor whatever you'd like um, delayed blowback system as I said eighteen inch chromoly barrel forty one forty um, MP five style lower I love it I love it I love this rifle I think you throw an optic on that rifle and oh my god you could destroy some people um, or I'm sorry excuse me um, animals pumpkins. Pumpkins. Pumpkins, pumpkins down yes. range. Um, all over the place. Yes. 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 Um, <laughs> virtual human people. Yeah. Um, video game. Um, so um, I definitely think it's a cool gun, though. And uh, make sure you check out Century Arms. We are a big dealer of Century Arms in Canik. We are part of their range program. This is it. This is part of it. So super cool. We shot the AK now, which we all didn't like, and that's not... I learned a lot about that AK actually because yeah. I talked to some other companies and it's the muzzle break on it oh, yeah. that ruins it. Oh, okay. 100%. And they're like, don't get me wrong, the metal butt pad hurts it a lot. But that muzzle break is designed, AKs like to go, I think it's like up 
up, uh, and I'm probably saying this like wrong. They jump right? away from you. Yeah, they they like to go up and left. Oh yeah. And so that muzzle brake is designed to push it right and and away it up and back. Or it's like up, left, and back at you. So that does that muzzle brake's designed to take it right and away from you. Mm. So that's why it slaps your shoulder, and oh, you're just like, oh, back, back into yeah, you. sweet, thanks. You just pulled out of my shoulder and slapped me. So. Horrible muzzle brake, um, and I'm and I'm like I said, I'm not 100% on which way there. If you ask an AK guru, they know right away. It's it's the way all K muzzle brakes are designed. I just don't play with it's them. It's spelled O U C H. Ouch. That's, that's it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um. yeah. <laughs> so um, so anyway, that's the century. Um, we normally do a hub talk today. I don't really have a hub talk for you, so I kind of have something for you to do. Okay. So. You got to go shoot in the ranges. Boom. Tucson, we got two lanes. How much is that to rent, by the way? That gun is twenty five bucks. Twenty five bucks. You rent it, and does that include the range time too, or is that? You, no, you... I hate to say that's plus the rent or that's fine. plus the range time plus the ammo. However, though, if you if you said to us, you know what, I want to buy a pistol or a rifle, you would either get the twenty five, you get the twenty five dollars back basically. So whatever your rental fee is, if you ever decide you want to buy that gun from us, we give it to you back. Boom. So. It's basically the lane fee and the ammo to try a new firearm. Just do it. It's worth it. It definitely is worth it. Pistols, 15 for one, 25 for two, 30 for three plus. So for $30, you can try every pistol in the case. Um, to add a suppressor is $10 to any gun. Uh, we have full autos for 65. All of them, you just have to buy our ammo and a lane fee. You can bring your own eyes, your own ears. You can bring your own targets, all that. So just our ammo. So... Anyway, I'm Michael. I'm Birdman. We'll see you next time. Thanks for subscribing. Hey, hit that like button and the little bell so you know when we put up a show. Yeah, make sure you check out thehubaz.com too. What?